Hello, 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 Taurus. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Whenever you come across this reading, I hope everyone is staying safe. How are y'all doing, Taurus, on this Sunday night? I love you guys. How are y'all doing? I love you guys. To new viewers, cross watchers, please come on in. Take what resonates. Reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. Listen, okay? I don't know your life, so you're going to have to reverse the roles, how they fit in your life, okay? But always remember, there are lessons, blessings, and confirmations in all my readings. All right? I love you guys. And uh, don't forget to like and share. I will really, really appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs> so let's see what's coming in your energy, my beautiful, beautiful Tauruses. Spirit guys, I ask you to give me clarity, understand the most of all I need your protection. All right, Taurus, let's see what's in your energy. Let's see what's popping, what's popping. What's popping? Okay, phone call. Uh, looking in the mirror. Uh, tick tock. Tick, tick, tick. And share the wealth is out here. Okay? Invitation is at the bottom of the deck, Taurus. Okay? Uh, uh, mending relationship is in reverse. All right? So, what this is telling me, my beautiful Taurus, is Taurus like, oh, Lord, here we go. I just see somebody eyes roll in the back of their head. Oh, boy, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Let me tell you something. I cannot control the energy. Energy is energy, okay? But the energy, I feel like, uh, <laughs> Taurus, y'all are something else. Y'all are something else, Taurus, I tell you. But I love you guys. I do. You will think I'm a Taurus. I'm so connected to y'all. I'm telling you, but we are earth signs, so we are connected. And that's why I love you so much. Like I tell my cupcake, my grandbaby, I love you, I love you, I love you. <laughs> so what we got here is that, and some of you are going to soon get a phone call. Okay? Some of you are going to get a phone call. It might be tonight at midnight. <laughs> it might be close to midnight tonight. Somebody going to get a phone call. All right? Somebody definitely going to get a phone call. Going to get a ring, 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 ring. And we ain't talking about a ring that go on your finger. We talking about a phone call. Some of you might get a ring. I don't know. But right now, the way this energy is going in this reading is that somebody's going to call you. Okay? Somebody done took a look in the mirror. It says, take a look at yourself. So, I feel like this is your person or whoever you're not in a connection with. This is them. They finally looked at themselves in the mirror. I feel like you forced this person to look at themselves. Okay. They had to look at themselves and, and they know that they know whatever this was that happened. They know they wasn't right. They know they was wrong. He or she knew they were wrong. Okay. So I feel as though with the men, the relationship in the reverse, this, <laughs> this, <laughs> I feel like you don't want to remend this relationship. Okay. Cause it's in the reverse. You don't want to, you don't want to, you don't want to mend it, but this person is trying to win you back. Maybe this present for some of you, they, this person might invite you out to dinner. Excuse me. May invite you somewhere. May ask you out. This person may, you, you know, trying to mend, you know, maybe let's go out to eat. Let's do something. And they may have a present. Like I say, they may have a ring in a box, baby. They might be ready to put put engagement ring on your finger. That's for some of you. That ain't for all of you. I'm not feeling a very heavy energy on that one, okay? But this person is wanting to, it says an invitation or chances are, this person is going to want going to probably call you and, and want to talk to you, want to talk about it over some dinner. And this person may come in with a present. You know, like a just because present for you, okay? Um, and so, my thing is this, is that this person knows that time is running out and they are, are actually moving off of impulse. It's like they got to hurry up and try to see what they can do to mend this relationship because they feel in their energy that you're getting away. Okay? This person is feeling in their energy, Taurus, that you're getting away. So that's why you got tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. They know that you are about to get away or see they're afraid that somebody is about to snatch you up. Okay. So let me see what's at the bottom of the deck here. Yeah. They, they feel like you're about to change your, you know, you're about to, you know, 
be known that you're single now, about to change your status. So this is someone that wants to mend a relationship, but I feel like you don't want to mend it. Or you're going to make it very difficult for, for this person. You're going to make this person this time really show, you know, they don't know it. But I feel like this is a manipulation a tactic that you're using that, you know, is, is that you want to make sure that this person mean what they say and say what they mean. So I feel like you're going to give this person a run for their money. You're going to make it hard for them. You, you're not going to make them think that they can just come back and it's just that easy. No, you're making it difficult for this person. So for some of you, for a very small percentage of you, you may get a ring. You know, when you get invited, this person may have an engagement ring for you. For some of you, this person may just have a, a, a present, you know, just because I love you. Just because I'm sorry. Because you made them look in the mirror. You see what I'm saying? You made them look in the mirror. So I'm going to pull out my message of love. The spirit, <clears throat> spirit guys is telling me to pull the message of love out. So I'm going to pull the message of love out. And let's go. We're going to find out what's going on. Here. Okay. Spirit guys talk to me for Taurus. Only time I pull out my message of love if the cards are going towards that energy, okay? Other than that, I would just pull out the regular cards. So, uh, in order for me to get a little more deeper into what's going on with this energy, then I will go towards the message of love cards, the oracle cards. So, you made this person look at themselves and they feel like time is running out. So, they're going to call you. And this person going to call you and ask you if you want to go out to eat. You want to go and grab something to eat. Um, you know, they could, you know, they're going to do this. Okay. Uh, they're trying to, yeah, they are trying to right their wrongs. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. Spirit guys, y'all is amazing. They're trying to right their wrongs. They wish they could right their wrongs, but I feel like they want to come in and right their wrongs. Um, they, they, they look at themselves. They realize that they can be a jerk. They, they realize she realized she can be an a-hole or he or she, however you put it, y'all, reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. But this person feels like, you know, that they made a mistake. They've done something that they shouldn't have done. And you force them to look at themselves in the mirror. And they say and they wish they could right the wrong or they're trying to come back and right their wrongs. Okay. Yeah, this is for, this is for some of you. Okay. Um, yeah, confusion. It says, I feel unclear about where we stand. So you really have this person all in their head. The reason why you have, I feel as though that you have this person all in their head, uh, Taurus, is because you, you left, you just went, you have went on unbothered. Okay. You have went on unbothered. You, you're not, you, you, and this is like leaving him or her confused. Like, usually you be tripping and going off and raising hell. I got to die. Why, why, why? And you just, you just, I feel like you just, you just moving on. It's like you ain't fighting about it no more. And so you leaving this person very confused. When I tell you they're confused, they're trying to figure out where they stand because you're not, you're not falling into, into their, into their manipulation anymore. And tell me more, spirit. Yeah, this person has a big ego and you got destiny here. This person trying to figure out their own life. And see, you ready to move on in a new chapter. That's what it is. You're ready. I'm trying to move on. Yep, you're trying to move on. And this person don't want you to move on. Or this person feel as though uh, that you, um, Taurus, uh, yeah, th that's why I was telling you. It's like TikTok. They feel like you're about to get away, that you're about to move on. And that is, that's because you are. You're ready for a new chapter. You're tired. You said, Miss Positive Thoughts and Energy, I'm tired of going through the same cycle, the same circle with this person that has a big ego. Okay? When you have an ego, it's like, uh, I let my pride get in the way of this connection. And that's what they did. And not only that, this person struggles with, with, with which way they want to go. They don't know where they want to go. They don't know the path that they're on. And so therefore, <clears throat> it's like when you come into, when you came into this person's life, However long that was, you was trying to make a difference. You was trying to show this person what this looked like, what real love looked like, what having something looks like with sharing and, 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 and building something looks like. And this person's ego, 
Okay, this person's ego uh, really got in the way of this connection because this person took it as you trying to be bossy or you trying to be like, you trying to act like they mama or you trying to act like they daddy or blah, 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 blah. They wasn't taking it as, you know, you both are trying to strive towards something, to have something, to build a foundation. You know, they were looking at it with the ego uh, ego side of things okay so now they're like i feel unclear where we stand and that's because you ain't you ain't uh, you ain't you, you you're not even you're not even falling into that trap anymore you're not falling into this per person in uh, 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 uh manipulation is what i'm trying to say because this person don't know where he or she going it says destiny i'm struggling to find the right path Hell, if they don't know where they're going, what makes you think they're going to know where they're going when they went, when y'all together? And you figure that out. And so this person wished that they can right their wrongs. And in fact, <laughs> I think it's a little too late. And they, and they know that it's a little too late because they feel like you are moving on to a new chapter. And I feel like a lot of you said, I'm moving on. I don't got time to wait on you. I don't got time for you to get it right. I'm not here to, make, to wait till you get it right. Okay, I'm moving on with my life. And so this person is like trying to ask you out on a date. That's why I feel like you don't want to mend this relationship. You got the mend relationship in the reverse. You see what I'm saying? So this person knows that it's it, it, in due time, you're going to get away like you're moving on. And you are. You are because this person has a big ego. Everything that you said, it's like when y'all was in a relationship, you you know, everything this, everything you said is like they just always thought that you was trying to control them. You wasn't trying to control them. You was trying to bring the best out of them, out of him or out of her. But they didn't see it in that way. They see it as somebody's trying to control them. It wasn't. It's like you wanted better and this person didn't see that it's all about advancing. Okay? So they let ego, they let pride get in the way of this connection of y'all's connection so now they're coming in <clears throat> the energy that they're going to ask you out an invitation they're going to the chances are the invitation they're going to ask you out maybe out to dinner or going to invite you to go somewhere maybe to a a party with them or dance or something with them or something whatever they're doing they're up to something okay they're up to maybe they're going to give you a present or give you a gift but i feel like you're not going to take this you're not going to take this invitation okay you're not you're not going to take this invitation Let's see what else is going on. Let's see what's in the uh, what's in the cards. Spirit guys, talk to me. Tell me more for Taurus. Yeah, I don't feel like you're going to take this invitation. Tell me more for Taurus energy. Let's see what's going on here, Taurus. What the card fell over? Yeah, this person, the king, uh, is the uh, king of swords. This is a person that's very logical. Okay, this is a logical person. This is your ex person. If you've been with me a long time, King of Swords is AKA your ex person. Their energy is his, his or her energy is in this uh, reading right now. This person is more of a logical thinker. What makes sense? They don't put emotions into anything. They only, they're only looking out for themselves. Okay, they, they, they're trying to act like they have emotions and that they're so confused, but they know they're thinking about themselves. Only reason why they're coming into this energy because they see you're happy and you're moving on. Okay, they see that you're recovering and, and see all you did in this energy, as you can see here, was y'all fight and argue, fight and argue, fight and argue. And you're tired of it. Yep, suddenly. I feel like for some of you, this was a sudden change because of their immatureness. The page of wands, you could have been dealing with a strong Sagittarius. Aries, Leo, <coughs> Sagittarius. Very strong Sagittarius in here. And I felt like that you, yeah, you suddenly, you suddenly shifted your energy. Okay, you shifted your energy. Now they're trying to come in, hurry up and come in, and hurry up and and try to 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 uh, uh give you a present. Uh, like I said, they they're moving very impulsively. Like I got to I got to I got to I got to hurry up and try to mend this relationship. When in fact you already know that this person has a big ego that he or she is not going to change. But see, this person's not doing it based off of their emotions. They're doing it based off of logical. They're doing what based off what of what makes sense to them. And what makes sense to them is that you're in their energy. What makes to, sense to them is that they could continue to manip manipulate you. What makes sense to them is that, uh, 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 you know, um, 
that you know uh, that they can get you back that's what makes sense to them but it doesn't work like that because they're very immature this person could be younger than you or you younger than them but they're very immature you're dealing with a grown boy or a grown girl not a grown man or a grown woman and so this person destiny they're struggling with where they want to go but they want to try to hold you back. And you say, no, I'm moving on. And, and so they know that time is running out. He or she know that time is running out. Time is at play here. And so they stagnant. They, they, they land there in the bed with the feet crossed, the hand behind their back. And they're stagnant and they're thinking and they're thinking and thinking of a way to try to get you back. To try to stop the clock. To try to convince you to change your mind. For you to have a change of heart. But you already see this person for who this person really is. And this person don't know where they're headed. So there's no way that they can leave this connection. Okay? This person's still juggling. They're still indecisive. They don't know what they want. He don't know what he wants. She don't know what she wants. But they want to rush to you. They want to get in their car and rush to you. They want to blow up your DM. You see what I'm saying? They want to rush to you and blow up your DM, jump in the car, get on the motorcycle, and rush over to the house because you walked away from them because you gained a lot of strength. And you walked away from a Cancer Scorpio place and now they want to run after you. And now they want to come because they know that um, now they want to try to come for some of you. They want to try to come and marry you right quick to keep you from getting away. <laughs> to keep you from getting away. They want to try to come and marry you with this ring here. Okay. And see, you release this person because of their selfishness. The devil in the reverse <clears throat> and the six of pentacles in the reverse. You release this person because of their selfishness. Could be an earth sign, could be a Capricorn. Yeah, you said I'm 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 good. I'm starting a new chapter of my life. You focus on your job. Look at here. You said I'm not being no fool. Look at that. I'm not being no fool. Yeah, you said I'm not being no fool. You're a high priestess. You're very in tune with yourself. You're very intuitive. You said I'm not being no fool no more. Yeah, you're right. The, their ego did get the best of them. This person has a lot of healing to do. Yeah, a lot of, you know, they just, they just trying to come back into your energy collectives because this person knows that you're getting ready to move on. This person feels that you have shifted your energy. This person feels that you have pulled your energy away from him or her. And they trying to, they're coming in and as impulse they're operating off of impulse off of what can they do what can he or she do to stop you from moving on uh can they right their wrongs because they know whatever they said whenever this fight whatever y'all had between each other they know it was some foul stuff that was said and they cannot take that back but they're trying to right their wrongs the mistakes that they said or the mistakes that they're made and now they're coming into the energy like they're so confused Okay, unclear where we stand. There's no unclear where we stand. Where we stand is that you do not respect me. You do not, you know, you let your ego get the best of you. You don't know where you headed. I know where I'm headed. So a lot of you focusing on your work. You know, you you not being a fool. You not you don't want to mend this relationship. You moving on to a new chapter of your life. And this person is trying to rush to you. Some of you, they may show up at your door. Okay, show up at your job, but you got communication, or they may just blow your phone up. Up. Ring, 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 ring. They're gonna keep calling you, calling you, calling, calling, calling you, and um, because you found, they finally looked in the mirror and realized that they, they are about, or they have lost a good thing. They have lost a good thing. That's why they they looked in the mirror. But still, regardless <clears throat> of the situation, they're not willing to change. They just want you back because they know that you're leaving out of their energy and someone else, just the fact of them thinking that someone else is going to hold you, kiss you, love you the right way, they're, they're operating from an impulse because you're moving on. You said, I'm trying to move on. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm trying to move on. When you had a chance, I want, ever since you walked away, you gained a lot of strength, a lot of confidence. Okay? You started believing in yourself. You started working on yourself. And this person, I feel like... You was trying your best to, to help, you know, you wanted this person to elevate with you, but this person refused to because they were looking at it from a different vibration. Okay. So a lot of things, a lot of fighting, a lot of things, a lot of mistakes. They wish they can right their wrongs. 
but it's too late. I feel like you said, no, I don't, I don't want to mend this relationship, you know? So don't be surprised. A lot of you get a, some text messages, some phone calls. This person may even drop by your house, uh, 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 uh follow you or may come to your job, you know, but, uh, you're moving on. You said, I'm done. I'm focused. I'm not going to be no fool anymore. I'm done with it. You're focusing on yourself. It's about you. Way to go, Taurus. Yeah, that part right there. Until next time.